In this video, I will show you how you can calculate the Z-score in Microsoft Excel. Z-score is a financial and statistical term which is used to measure how much the point is away from the mean in terms of standard deviation values. So, if the Z-score is 1, it means it's one standard deviation away from the mean. And if the Z-score is greater than 0, it means that it's a positive and above the mean. And if it's a negative, it means it's below the mean. A Z-score is also called a standard score because it allows the comparison of different types of variables by standardizing the distribution. And now let's go and see how we can calculate it. Okay, so I have this table of some salespeople and the number of sales that they performed. And I want to calculate the Z-score for these numbers. So in order to do that, I will use a function called standardize. X is the data point in my data set, which is in cell B2. The mean is the average of all these numbers, and in order to calculate it, I will use the function average. And I will calculate the average for these numbers. And I'll press F4 to fix these cells. Then standard deviation, I will use STDEV. I have two types of standard deviations, the dot .p and dot .s. Dot .p is used if you are having the whole population and s if you are calculating it for a sample. In my case, it's the whole population, all my employees. And again, I will press F4. And press Enter. So the Z-score is 1.47, which means it's above the mean. And it's 1.47 standard deviation units away from the mean. Now, if I expand the calculation to all the other cells, you can see the Z-score for all the numbers. I hope this video is helpful for you to let you know how to calculate the z-score in order to standardize your variables. Don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to my channel.